before I start this video, I know one thing. This is going to look confusing. And I was surprised when I threw this shirt on. I should have already knew, but um, <clears throat> here you go. I'm headless. Kind of headless. <laughs> we got a serious problem. Man, I don't want to say a problem. We got a serious topic. Now, there are problems in this topic. But today, we are talking about the future of gaming. You know, gaming just is a whole nother life. You can just forget about this crappy world and go to your new world. You own the thing, whatever you want. I could be headless if I wanted to, and I ain't talking about no puns, okay? But let's start off with a gaming event that's coming up soon. I, I think it's coming up. It is coming up soon. I don't know if there's any more before it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't stone me. I know Nintendo will have one. <laughs> I know PlayStation gonna have one because <laughs> they ain't with E3, and that's what we're talking about. E3. <clears throat> What's going on? What, what are y'all going to bring to the table this year? Because PlayStation said, uh, we we don't want them. We don't want it. We're going to do our own little thing. Because hey, 2019 is quiet. 2019 is very quiet. The only thing that's going to be happening in 2019 is that things are going to get announced. Oh, wait, hold up. Pause. Things are going to get announced, yeah. But there's like two things coming up. Two things. Two things. <laughs> was that a first quick? I hope it was. I'm replay this. If it was, then it is. Google Google Stadia. I can't speak. Google 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 Google. There you go. Google Stadia. Then the Dislikes um Xbox. Uh, you know Xbox. They they throwing all these names at your boy, and I don't even know what they got. Like five consoles coming out. Y'all got the money, so y'all doing your thing. So keep it up. I'm trying to see Xbox Drive 2020. I'm trying to see y'all drive. I'm trying to take it back to the good old Xbox 360 glory days. You hear me? I'm sorry, but Xbox 360 is better than PlayStation 3. Hey, do it to me or not. My opinion. Hey, show your opinion. Do what you want, man. But Xbox, we got the discless console coming out because uh, <clears throat> not apparently people don't buy physical things anymore. It's all digital. The, the world is turning digital. You, you see what happened? Who knows about um, Movie Gallery, the old store that sold all the D DVDs, or Blockbuster? Like, those are physical. But my mans, my mans came out with digital, and people were like, I don't gotta go to the store no more and get that? I can just buy it right here? You real? You serious? Alright, I'm saving that gas money, and that's exactly what happened. <laughs> that's exactly what happened. You don't see nobody going there no more. What you got? What you got? You probably got Netflix, Hulu, Amazon Prime. Is it Amazon Prime? I'm tripping. But yeah, Amazon got their own streaming service. Apple coming out with their own streaming service. Things are changing, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, there's still going to be movie theaters. For sure. <laughs> but DVDs, I mean, they're going to keep making them. But you ain't going to find a store strictly for um, physical DVDs. You're going to find them at, um, what? Uh, let me think, let me think. Walmart? Target? I mean, any other store that comes to your mind. But digital... Is the wave and physical is dying. And speaking of digital, um, that Google Stadia, I talked about it last video. I just want to see what they're gonna do about the um, <clears throat> the internet problems. I mean, it's not even is it? It's not even their problem. It's your problem for not having good enough internet. That that sounds like a you problem, but still, that's gonna hurt something. So Google, I'm I'm curious what y'all gonna do with that. But like I said, if you got five up, five down, don't expect to be running that at some good resolution, my friend. <laughs> don't don't expect that. But E3, PlayStation's not there this year. PlayStation said we got our own little thing. We're we're over here. Come here. PlayStation hasn't been talking. PlayStation quiet, a little too quiet. What's happening, PlayStation? Where y'all at? What y'all doing? Y'all good? Y'all coming out the PS5, or you're right. They cooking. They are really cooking up in there. But let me get back to E3. All the all the things. Let, let me talk about the things that's gonna happen at E3. Or most not most of it. <laughs> some of it. Xbox gonna be there. I know they're announcing that console. Xbox Scarlet. That's the name. Am I right? Am I wrong? Nintendo. They're coming out with two more versions of the Switch. And they said that. It's not gonna, you ain't gonna be able to take the, um, the controls off. It's gonna be just like, it's gonna be on there permanently, and you're not gonna be able to take it off. 
And what else? And they're coming out. That's the cheaper version. And they're coming out with a higher version. And I guess an original Switch that came out is just going to be staying. It's going to be in the middle. And I think they're going to lower the price down on that. Probably like 250 I can see them lowering the original Switch by like 250 I can see that having the, the new Switch by 300 And the uh, cheapest Switch probably like 200 or lower. 200 or lower, somewhere around like that. But hey, you got to like Nintendo because... You not find any other Nintendo games nowhere else. Where are you finding them? PlayStation. You're not gonna find Mario, <laughs> Mario Kart, on PlayStation or Xbox. That's why Nintendo's there. You ain't gonna get those beautiful exclusives, and they know you're gonna pay for them exclusives. They said no, nah, they gonna stay around because we ain't going nowhere else. But. Let me get some. Let me get. Let me. Let me come to some else. Cyberpunk. <clears throat> Twenty seventy-seven. A beautiful. I. I'm gonna say beautiful. I would just say out of this world. Literally out of this world. They saying something. E three this year is big for them. They said we got something big going on for E3. And I'm here like, what are they going to say? Are they going to like, they can't do that. No, they can do that. They can do that. Derry, Derry just popped in my head. Xbox, there. PlayStation, you're out of here. Cyberpunk, they can team over Xbox. I'm not even saying it's going to be an exclusive game. But I'm saying they can be like, oh yeah, by the way, Cyberpunk 2077. <laughs> Here on Xbox Scarlet, what? It, they got it. You won. You won E3. I mean, you already won because PlayStation's not there, so um, that that that's that. <laughs> but they could announce that just to confirm that it's gonna be on new consoles. I mean, well, we already know for sure it's gonna be on new consoles, but just them saying it, it's gonna warm people's hearts. So they probably gonna say something about release date. Hopefully, they say something about yeah. I mean, dud, no dud. It's gonna be on next gen. Like, come on, speaking of next gen, let's talk about current gen right now. Let's talk about current gen, like, right now. Xbox One, Xbox S, Xbox One S, and, you know, I don't know how many consoles Xbox got. And PlayStation, PS4, PS4 Pro, PS4 Slam, blah, blah, blah. It's all 60 frames. Are they going to change, or are they going to improve on the frames on the next gen consoles? I'm curious. Because people always complain about, man, oh, oh, 60 frames on these consoles, man. That's what everybody talking about. And you know, you can't tell the difference in frames. Go to 120 from your 60. That's double. You're going to be like, what is this whole time? What is this whole time? It's on PC. It's on PC. Then why am I here? That's exactly what's going to happen. But they're going to have to... I don't even know. They probably might not even. Maybe. I don't know what they're going to have in on consoles, bro. Man. They got to be cooking. But all we know is that it got to be improved. But, you know, everybody's always like better resolution. So, y'all got to have some better resolution. Y'all got to be. Hey, y'all got to pump something up. It got to be better than the PS4 Pro. Got to be better than the the Xbox One S. It, is it an S? I think it's, yeah, you know, the best Xbox, let's just say that. It has to be good. If it's not, where are we going, my G? I'm clicking on my laptop, but where are we going? We're, we're staying here. Y'all gonna have to improve on that. But I'm gonna talk about those new consoles. I'm gonna talk about a new console. Well, I'm already talking about a new console, but before I do, let's talk about PlayStation. <laughs> PlayStation said we're good. Like, they really said we're good. How long, how long has it been? 24 years? It's been 24 years. Well, that, yeah, 24 years since E3 started, and PlayStation's been with them. 24, 23. I keep, a, I keep second guessing myself. Let's just say 24, 23, or let's just say the 20s. That's how long Xbox, I mean, Xbox, PlayStation's been with them, and now PlayStation said we're good. This is the first time in history, ladies and gentlemen. 2019, PlayStation is not going to be there. They doing something, or. They got nothing. And they say, okay, we just gonna throw all our pots and pans to the PS4. And that's it. That's it. That's it. Where's Last of Us 2? Naughty Dog. PlayStation. Where where's where's the Last of Us 2? 
<sighs> you know, that's the only thing I regret for not buying a PS3. Not being able to play The Last of Us. The Last of Us. Now we got Last of Us Part 2 coming out? Y'all saw the trailer. Y'all saw the gameplay. They literally released a video on PlayStation, an hour long video of it just raining. Raining? And LS. I said LS. The Last of Us 2. And I watched the whole thing. I fell asleep to the video. I legit fell asleep to the video. I always fall asleep to rain. Rain's just the best thing to fall asleep to, but I'm getting off I'm getting off track. But y'all know that gameplay that y'all showed <laughs> that y'all showed. Oh, y'all showed the gameplay that they showed of Cyberpunk 2077. My guy said We keep wondering if it's on PlayStation 4 or Xbox. But we haven't taken it taken into consideration if it's on the next gen. Like what if we're seeing the PS5 gameplay right here? What if we're seeing an Xbox Scarlet right here? What if we're seeing these next gen consoles on Cyberpunk 2077? Go look at the gameplay because the gameplay looks gorgeous. Just just look at it. Out of this world. Beautiful. And you tell me if it looks if that's console, then what is it on PC? That is dangerous, bro. That that's dangerous. But Xbox, they doing their thing. Xbox Scarlet. And Xbox Anaconda. Yeah, it's Anaconda. I'm pretty sure it's Anaconda. I don't know, bro. Xbox got like a lot of things. But I know for sure they're doing something this year. They are not, well, both, both of them doing something this year. Because I, I wonder where PlayStation, I don't I know it's probably later in the year when PlayStation hosts their own event, but I know E3 is coming up like right now. So Xbox, they going to announce that. They going to show something. Nintendo, they probably going to showcase their new consoles also. And like I said, Cyberpunk, they're probably saying a release date, and they said that it should be in 2021. When Cyberpunk is released, hey, don't hold me to it. But they do that plan, and they release the next consoles in 2020. Then that's just the right. That's it's leading up to it. Like okay, I want to. No, I think it's gonna be released on um last gen also. Last gen also, I think it's also gonna be released on that because it, it, it's crazy how they say because this is gonna be last gen when those new consoles come out. You better know that your boy is gonna be on that. I gotta get the I got I have to get the Xbox now. Halo Infinite. Why have I not been talking about that? Halo Infinite. Like, are you kidding me? Your boy's been a die-hard Halo fan since the beginning. Since that man was a toddler, maybe a toddler, not a toddler, but since I knew what an Xbox 360 was, I can tell you the story of me getting my Xbox 360. Should I tell you? I'm gonna tell you anyway. Christmas Day. Papa walked in. Papa said. Hey, you want it? Me and my brother. I mean, I'll take it. Then if you you offering it, if you're offering it, hey, where my Looney Tune games at? What's Lego Star Wars? I I need that. I need that, please, sir. And you didn't find me for months. You didn't find me for months. I probably replay those games. About a hundred times because those only games I had. Those only games I had at the time that some beautiful came. Gears of War, Halo, Lost Planet, Left for Dead. Like this is the making of Malcolm. Like right now, this is the making of Malcolm. That's what your sixty major boy. But don't get don't get me wrong. I had a lot of consoles. From the beginning of one, I mean from the beginning of the PlayStation, from the beginning of Nintendo. It's all beautiful. All the handhelds don't even start me with that. Your boy had a DS. Your boy had a PS. <coughs> I don't want to talk about it, but I'm going to say it anyways. Your boy had a PS Vita. You know, the sad thing that could never succeed. I don't, PlayStation, this could be a whole nother video, but PlayStation, why you don't get... Well, why doesn't PlayStation get their handhelds right? Well, what's happening with that? I'm getting so off topic, but... I'm not though, cause it's all gaming. That's a problem that needs to be solved right now. But E3, hey, there's gonna be some announcements, so y'all keep your head up. So what? E what E3 is an announcement? So keep your head up for that, for some new consoles. Keep your head up for Cyberpunk. 
if you're into the game and keep your head up for that PlayStation event that's coming up. Because PlayStation and Microsoft, I know they fighting. They talking that shit, man. They talking it. They said, no. Xbox said, oh, they holding their own event? So we're going to release it before them. I mean, not release it. We're going to announce it before them. That's exactly what they're doing. But PlayStation not even worried about it. I hope not. I mean, I don't think so. They chilling right now. But I'm just... I just want to see who's going to rule the next gen. I just want to see who's going to be PlayStation. And who's going to be Xbox. You know, the boys are always beefing. The boys are always beefing. I spit all over the camera. The boys are always beefing. But it's, it's going to be a good year for um, announcements. It's going to be a good year for announcements this year. 2019 going to be... 2019 going to be dry. 2019, yeah. 2019 is very dry. Yeah. 22. 2019 is very dry, but 2020 is where you want to be at, and that's in the future. So, y'all, we all gonna have to wait. But thank you for letting me take some time out of the day. It's been your boy Malcolm Wright, and I'll catch you, guys and girls, in the next video. Peace out.